going under. Guys, what's going on? Boogie here. Welcome back to the awesome episode of Paint With Me. We will be rocking some awesome painting today, as always. All right, first, but let's start off with the supplies that we'll be using. Awesome container from the takeout. Soup container for our water to wash our brushes. Wait. Brush, a roller, sponge brush, stick to mix the color. White, yellow, blue, black. Red. Paint marker. I have two sizes. The big one and a small one. We like two sizes. Rag. So we're going to use blue and white. And we're going to blend these two on the canvas. So we're going to start with the blue from the top and go down to the white. Blue. Ah, so yummy. A roller. Just get moisture onto the roller. Let's just roll the paint. Rolling, rolling, and it's cool because you get some like really awesome texture. And get the corners. Roll from right to left, left to right, getting all the corners. Doo -doo -doo. All right, and then from here, earlier I had explained that we can we were gonna use a white paint, but that the canvas is already white, so we really don't need to, but if you want to use a white, it's okay. So if you were to use a white, you will actually start from the bottom and blend it up. But in this case, I'm just gonna leave it as it is and it's gonna dry much faster. So we are gonna use without the white paint and just use a canvas. Cool. All right. So now we got our base coat down. So we could kind of let it dry a little bit. And make sure, guys, to wash your brush and your rollers. So just dip, dip. Just squeeze out some of that excess water off the roller. Get new fresh water, because we never really want to blend the colors. I'm back. All right, now we get to paint the next part two of the painting. So we are gonna be painting some cool buildings, some cityscape. So we are going to make the building's purple. So from earlier blue, we are going to add red to make the purple. So look, we're making magic. We're blending things. And mix. So when you're mixing, you just want to add a little bit first and just to see where the color is going to be blended. So if it's a little too red, like this, we could all, we're gonna add blue to make it a little bit more darker. All right, so now it's becoming darker, so the purple's coming back. So it's more like a violet. I don't know if you can see it. But look, it is magic. Color changed. All right, for this one, I want the purple to be a little lighter. So we're going to add white. How this white will go. I blend. Cool. Now you can see the color changing to lighter purple. Here we go! We are rocking the buildings! So roll it up and down, side to side. Make sure that all the paint is on the roller. So this time we're gonna go from the top to bottom. So you're gonna have this as a little building, the background. So you could just kind of roll. Rolling. Cool. So you could kind of roll up down. First building looks good. And we're going in a little lower and making our second building roll down. And come up. And from the top, roll down. And we're gonna make another one a little smaller next to it. Cool. 
Now to the third layer. We're actually going to add more cool buildings. So this time we are going to use mm, black and white. So it's going to be a little bit more gray. So as further it comes to you, or closer it comes to you, the, the color gets lighter. So we are going to mix and make kind of a gray. Fun little mixing stick. So pretty. So nice when the colors blend. They do cool magic. Add a little bit of blue to pop the color a little bit more. So we got some cool bluish, grayish color happening. And starting from my right, we are going to come in front of the darker building and just come down. So cool. Very easy. Just go down and to the side. Do -do -do. And the building, another one's growing. And up and down. All right, so now we get to paint the main character on the center of the awesome canvas that we've been making. All right, so now we're gonna start off with, I can't find my white. Bam, there it is, the white. Bam, we got the white. We got the yummy white paint. Voila! Make sure the roller is clean also. We are using white. We don't want any color on it. So I'll make sure it's clean. Now, our character is a Rubik's Cube. So he's square. Very simple. And he'll be rocking an awesome b-boy hat. So we are going to it doesn't have to be perfect square. It could have movements. It's better when it's not perfect. So here we go. We're gonna start right here. Very simple. Just side to side, up and down. Square. Cool, cool. We got it. We got the main character down. Where? Right in the center. He owns a canvas. Doo -doo -doo. Cool, cool. Very nice, very nice. All right, that was it. Make his cool hat. And a little bit of the water on the brush, just a little moisture. Draw a little fun mountain on top of his head. So, a little half moon. Half moon on his head. On top of the square. Doo -doo -doo -doo. Half moon. Now, we are adding the colors to the Rubik's Cube guy. So, now we have to actually make little blocks inside. The white cube, yellow, red, blue. So, but before we do that, we're gonna actually draw a little bit of the grid that we understand which part that we're gonna color. We're just gonna do a little bit of a outline. So we're gonna do one, two, and two lines from top to bottom. Bam. It's like a tic-tac-toe, actually. So now we are going to color the blocks in. So I'm going to choose this one to make it blue. And good to go. 
Make sure to cover all the white area, the square that you're coloring. I think I'm going to take, make another black blue. I think I'll use this one right here. Just the coloring. Very simple, just coloring it in. You already have the outline, so you're just kind of following it. And when you think the paint feels thick, you can always add a little bit of water and it will go on very smoothly. That looks good. Wash the brush. Get all that excess water out. Awesome yellow. Yellow looks like mustard. Right here in the center. And color that block. It is nice yellow. So pretty. Nice and bright. You just actually go over the blue. It's okay. It'll get covered later on. And doo -doo -doo. Well, this paint is a little bit thick, so I'm just going to add a little bit of the water. And I think I'm going to pick down here. So you can actually pick whatever block you want to color. But make sure they're not right next to each other. You kind of want them to be kind of a distance. Mm, this is looking good. All right. So now we are going to move on to the red. That's it's a red. Oh, there's a funny noise. It's okay. And I think I want the center. So we're gonna pick the center. And color in with the red. Doo -doo -doo -doo. Red. Oh. Just want to get some little bit of water. And make sure you stay in that square space when you're coloring. All right, that looks good. And I'm gonna pick another red, another cute. I'm gonna go right here. Pretty. Look at all these awesome colors. They're coming together. Oops, I came off on the space. It's okay. We can always go back. Nice, perfect. Utilize the blue that we already have and add some white and black. Bam, here it is. Here's a white. We're just gonna blend them, the three colors together. Now we're gonna take actually the red again. And we are going to draw like a triangle-like sneaker at the bottom of the canvas. So now taking the brush, do, 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 do. Cut at the bottom a line and it's almost like a triangle, but a little rounded. And we are going to do the same on the other side. Coming, backing up. Backing up. And same thing as we opposite side. And uh, coming in, coming in. All right, getting close. 
to the final. Now we are taking the big fat juicy Sharpie marker, the black for the cool outline. Let's start. So we are gonna start from the top from this. Hot little white mountains. Awesome B-boy. We are gonna write B-boy across. So we are rocking the B. And little slash. And we are gonna write B. Oh. Bam! That's hot. That looks good. And now, outline comes in. So we are gonna start outlining. Oops. Little roughness, but it's okay. Ooh. And now we are gonna draw outline. And a little dot for the top of the hat. Little lines coming down, like a little umbrella. Cool. Look at this hat. It's awesome. And now we're just gonna do outline of all the cues. But before we actually do that, let's do the boom box. So we are gonna do two circles, simple circles, round circle and circle. Looks like a big eyeballs. And in it, now we're just gonna come down and just. One, one speaker, and on to the next speaker, and, and our second speaker. Now we're just gonna outline the box. Boom box. And we're gonna actually get a little little tiny little square in the center between the two circles, the two speakers. Boom. A little square. And a little boom. Perfect. And now we are going to outline the squares. Starting on this side. Just outline. Simple outline. Just following the outskirts of the box. And to the bottom. Look how sharp it's coming out. And up here, a little dash. And now all the blue line you draw earlier, now you're just gonna go on top. So you're just gonna trace it. Very easy. Tracing. Tracing. Looking nice, but now he needs his eyes. So you're doing a little fun smiley face. So now you're just gonna make a little arc, so it's gonna be little mountains. Little mountains. Mountains. It's okay if you go over the speaker. And now we have a big smiley, so you're doing a upside down, almost like a U, a wide U. And Go over it again to make it thicker. Very happy. You like our happy man. Happy little cube dude. And now we have to work at the bottom. So we are just gonna rock up the sneakers and his legs. So simple, very simple it's two sticks. Here we go from the top, the bottom of the square, and just connecting to the sneaker. Same on the other side. From the bottom of the square, and just connects up to the top of his awesome sneakers. And now we have to give him his awesome arms. So we're gonna rock it out, just a little, just simple. And now we're gonna bring his left. It's gonna be holding. So you're gonna do like a side U kind of shape. And we are just gonna Connect. Bam! So now he's holding his awesome boombox. And now we're gonna give the awesome lines for the shoelace. So 
So we're just gonna do three single lines. One, two, three. And now we're gonna draw the little bunny hoopy ribbon. So it's just gonna be almost like a like an A, but like a little almost like a little butterfly. So we're just going to and then for you. Three. One, two, three. And then voila! And this is it! We did it! We made it happen! We made our Rubik's Cube. And now, we're gonna get a little, oh, you always wanna sign your artwork. It's your masterpiece. So give a little tag. Have a little fun tag, mines. Bam! So we're done. We made our awesome piece. We signed it. So we're, we did it again. And thanks again for joining me on Paint With Me. And we'll make something awesome again next time. Chowing under.